It's okay, though. I will tell you what. Okay. Two years ago, I did some stuff. I'm sorry if you've seen some of the stuff. You know, I'm a changed person. Apparently, this guy is like, he's part of the WL community or something. Apparently, he had an, an only two years ago where he did gay, I guess. Who cares? Um. This is going worse than I thought it was. Um. <laughs> Although, I will say, how old is this guy? This guy looks like he's like 22. Jesus. And did the community hate him? So you well, it's the WL community, and I'm pretty sure they all are homophobic as f so they probably would hate him. That'd be my guess. I have no idea. Years ago. I say that. That's not fair. I'm sorry. I say that making that assumption because of bad experiences that I've had with um, majority black communities online. But I maybe I, maybe they don't care as much. I'm not sure. I don't know. Listen, Tyler, the creator, is bisexual. Okay. It's not about you being gay, gang. It's about you not telling nobody <laughs> and hiding it and coming a whole different alias like you're a new person. That's not cool, bro. At all. You got kids that watch you, gang. My little brother watch you, bro. And I'm not allowing him to watch you no more because you're just trying to cover it up. Like, it's okay for you to be gay. Nobody cares, bro. Nigga, I did a stream with Brandon and Barbara. If you think I'm homophobic, think that. I don't give a f But all that sex shit, I know that's going to become a troll because y'all niggas troll about the P. Diddy shit. All that shit, I don't give a Y'all niggas don't take it like this serious with kids. And that's why they end up gay at 11 years old. It don't make no sense. I did not have sexual relations with that man. I'm just kidding. I did. Possibly. <sighs> Cat's out of the bag. It's okay. Um, what else do I have to say? I don't know. Thank you to all my people that have been sticking up for me. I understand if you're bad. Shit hit the fan. I don't, don't go on Twitter. I, I deleted... No, I'm just kidding. I didn't delete Twitter. I have been cautiously avoiding it. It's like landmines everywhere I go. Okay, I was dealing with some addiction problems. Addic A couple of them. Addicted to cock. Say it. Yes. But... No excuse there. Uh, wait, I guess. Just trying to give you some background background here. What else was I going to say? He is Jinxie's Orbiter. Jinxie's the guy whose podcast you turned down because you didn't know who it was. I never turned that podcast down. I followed up his message. He didn't respond to me, but okay. Yeah, that was me. Um, I f up. I won't do it again. Won't do what again? Be gay or do gay porn? Or is I'm he gay, kidding. or did he just do um, gay porn? I am dead serious about not doing it again. That was a dark time. Rough, rough time. 89,000? Who the fuck am I? Jinxie? Hey, love my brother Jinxie. Not like that, though. Just my brother. I don't know. Stay off Twitter, please. For Shout out to you. Shout out to Steve. You know, bro, I just as a quick thing, I know it doesn't matter. Who cares? Also nice. Um, listen, apparently me saying the subhuman thing on Twitter was like super transphobic. Enough to perma ban me from Twitch. OK, pretty sure was Nick Merckx just saying that trans people weren't real and they were all child predators or did he actually call them? He got a weak ban. They were saying it's like saying the N word. I didn't know that. Nick Merckx returns to Twitch and addresses ban for using transphobic. I think he got a one week ban for for calling him and attack helicopters. How? What? I'm not. But and to be clear, I'm not calling for his ban. I'm not saying that he should be like perma ban or anything. But Jesus.